The Justice Department says it has already completed its review of what was taken from President Trump's Mar-a-Lago home. Tom Fitton, the Judicial Watch president, joins me now. Good morning to you, Tom. Uh, we understand some Good of these morning. materials uh, were covered by attorney-client privilege. Is that right? It is. That's what the government told the court yesterday in trying to mm. fend off uh, President Trump's desire for a special master to review this material independently. And what does that tell you? It tells you they asked, they got too much material out of Trump's home. You know, by their own admission, it's material that they shouldn't have. I don't think they've even given it back to Trump yet. And, uh, you know, they're expecting the court to trust them that they fairly evaluated the materials that they seized from Trump's home. And, you know, you just spent 15, 20 minutes uh, doing some reporting that tells uh, Americans and, frankly, the court why they can't trust of this FBI. They're out to get Trump. Uh, this raid was part of that, I'm convinced. And uh, now they've kind of had to admit not only did they take these attorney client records, but despite Trump's request and despite the court's interest in appointing a special master, they're already taking mm. the documents they've taken and they're sharing them with an outside agency to do, quote, a damage assessment. Uh, the court's got to put a stop to this and freeze it all. If I were Trump, I'd be asking for that immediately. Well, will a special master to overview the, 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 the looking at these documents, does that make much of a difference? It would, because it certainly uh, it, it puts all the documents that were at issue before an independent party mm -hmm. that presumably uh, Americans can trust because they can't trust the FBI and the Garland Justice Department. And, you know, and it's not just attorney client material. You know, the, the argument is that the president had a right to these documents and his taking them out of the White House was his prerogative as president. They weren't classified. They weren't presidential records. The court has got to address that issue. Uh, and I think President Trump should ask the court to address that issue, uh, because if that's the case, the whole basis for the raid, the whole basis for the investigation was conceived in sin. Well, uh, we're going to have to leave it there, Tom. Thank you. But I have a feeling we're going to have a lot more to talk about as this uh, investigation, quote unquote, uh, un, you, know, um, you know, releases more details and we know where and how this thing will be resolved. But Tom Fitton, great stuff as always, Tom. Thank you very much.